This is the Peter Channel Afternoon News on this Sunday afternoon, July 31st, 2016. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Peter Wiggins. It is 12.45 p.m. on this Sunday afternoon. And you know your news runs. The top story at 12.45 is Washington, where Kids are caught. The father of Muslim U.S. soldier slated the director in 2004 said Sunday that Donald Trump had a, a black soul indicating he lacked empathy and compassion. One person was killed and four were injured early Sunday in two separate shootings in a credit area in downtown Austin, Texas, police said. Friends mourn victims of a hot air balloon crash in Lockhart, Texas. Presidential candidate Donald Trump doesn't like the fact that two of the three scheduled debates conflict with NFL primetime games. Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan has launched a shakeup of the country's armed forces that dismissed nearly 1,040 military personnel in the wake of a failed coup attempt early this month. A vicious Saturday night flash flood in Elkhart City, Maryland, destroyed homes and businesses, leaving at least one person dead in public care of her, Larry Hogan. After the murder of a French priest on Tuesday by a who who pledged allegiance to so-called Islamic State Muslim joined Catholics throughout Europe to celebrate Mass on Sunday. In his homily at the close of Mass of Krakow, Pope Francis told his immense crowd of young pilgrims from across the globe not to surrender to us, but boldly embrace God died as those who would trust in mercy. Tunis, Tunisia. Tunisia's parliament passed the vote of no confidence in Prime Minister Habib said on Saturday effectively disbanded the government of the U.S. An ISIS stint taken in a oil field near the northern Iraqi city of Kirk has ended with the attackers killed and their captives safely freed, a senior security source told the CNN from the city. In Paris, an Air France flight attendant struck in the head of tourist season and affected dozens of passengers. Mogadishu, Somalia. Two car bombs were set off outside a police base in Somalia's capital Sunday, killing 13. Tokyo, former Japanese defense minister Yuriko Koke is supposed to become Tokyo's first female governor with local media forecasting her as the winner. Cologne, Germany. Police were bracing for about 30,000 at a rally on Sunday to support of Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan as well as thousands of counter demonstrations. Austin, Texas, Texas law concealed handgun licensed soldiers to carry their weapons in the public and university buildings, classrooms, and dorms Saturday Monday, with also the 50th anniversary of the mass shooting at the University of Texas. A gunman attack that a gunman and young adults in a suburban Seattle home killing two people at the fire pit before firing more shots from the roof, the grandmother of the one of the witnesses said. Los Angeles, Tesla Motors Incorporated considering that the possibility of a crash prevention system failed of its fatal crash of a Model S, not its autopilot system. Boston, residents in Boston will have a chance to weigh in in the cities. Plan to equip police officers with body cameras. As City Council Committees is holding a hearing on Thursday evening at the Military Committee Center to review the police department's plan to buy up the cameras. The department has promised for months up to provide up to 100 cameras to patrol officers for a six month test. Spavia, Massachusetts, Massachusetts men was seriously injured when the motorcycle was operated struck a higher barrier and crashed. The 4th of July is perhaps the most beloved holiday in the country of this year. Rebels had an initial reason to celebrate the national average price for the gallon. Gasoline dropped to 2 dollars cents, the lowest price in 13 years. Rocket readers not only recaptured the central to travel business model that Elon Musk laid out in the space action and the future of commercial space travel. Black holes have voracious appetites as those objects which is so dense that not even light can escape their gravitational pull, shut on and gas and cell debris, that emit powerful bursts of X-rays created in what is known as a cosmic X-ray. Bad news if you want to use dietary supplements, a new study that some great boards have warned for you. The study published by Consumer Reports claims that many cases of those dietary supplements that you think are helping you stay healthy may be doing you harm. Since Daniel 36 and infected with Zika virus in late April, Danger signs appeared in her fetus as 23 weeks she grappled with the decision whether to report as Zika cases in Puerto Rico are skyrocketing. The more now, the most basic of the baking ingredients flour is at the center of a complicated question. How did it become contaminated with a bacteria normally found in animal feces? Peter Channel is on 12.49 on this Sunday afternoon, and it is time out for a sport report. Tonight, this afternoon, the Boston Red Sox will try to 
They're in a split of a series with the Los Angeles Angels in the finale of a four-game series at Angel Stadium and game time, 335 p.m., which is 12:35 p.m. their time. St. Petersburg, Florida. The New York Yankees trade Andrew Mill really disappointed them after trade to the Cleveland Indians. Wow. Also, traded to the Indians from the Milwaukee Brewers as Milwaukee Brewers catcher Jonathan LaCroix as Milwaukee General Manager David Stern confirmed on Sunday. Despite the best, Jason Day could do something else. Only Tiger Woods has done a reach member of this afternoon. The story of the 98 PGA Championship so far hasn't been in the play, but Saturday's unfavorable weather conditions and playing the mishaps. Peter Chow News on 12.50 on this Sunday afternoon, and it's talking about a traffic and transit report on this Sunday afternoon. Pity! Let's study off out in with the MBTA alerts. Where? It's looking good on the subway, on the commuter rail. Looking good and on the ferries, they are looking good. All right! Look at the highways and byways of New England and New York City on this Sunday afternoon where 95 of both fans also on the bumps all the way to George Washington Bridge. Lawrence Pressway is sold from Hempstead to Manhattan. 278 at both ends it's sold from the Maris and Harris Bridge right to the Brooklyn. Bill Parker is back there for JFK Airport to Brooklyn. Lincoln Tunnel is sold on both ends. 95 and then the South Pantai and it is backed up from Fairfield all the way at the Greenwich. 95 and the North Pantai is backed up at the seventh stretch. 95 of both ends also on New Haven stretch. 95 and the South Bend Tidal also around the Brentford stretch. 95 and the North Bend Tidal also East Haven stretch. 95 and the South Bend Tidal is back to the Old Saybrook stretch. 95 and the South Bend Tidal is back to the New London Old Saybrook. 95 and the North Bend Tidal also before 395 out of New London. 91 and the South Bend Tidal. It is slow around 691 in Meriden, Connecticut. 91 and the North Bend Tidal. It is backed up around I-84 in Hartford, Connecticut. Out in Rhode Island. It is looking good in I was in Bowie's the Ocean State. Out in Albany, New York. New York State 3 on the East Pantide. It is backed up from Interstate 90 to 787 in Albany Stretch. New York State 3 South Pantide is backed up after 3 after 787 in Albany, New York. I 87 on the North Pant South Pantide is backed up from Troy all the way down to the 3 in Albany. 91 in the South Pantide is backed up from Chickley all the way to Springfield. Mass Parking in the West Pantide is also from Charlton 94 Surbridge. Mass Parking in the East Pantide is backed up from Surbridge. I-84 East Pantide is backed up from Route 20 to the Mass Park in Surridge. Mass Park in West Pantide. It is backed up from Millbury all the way to 290 in Worcester. 290 in the West Pantide is backed up from the Shrewsbury Stretch. 295 in the South Pantide. A little sold from sort of 290 in Marber. 120 in the North Pantide. A little sold from the Needham Stretch. 95 in the North Pantide. A little sold from Canton. 24 North Pantide is backed up before Route 120 in Canton. Route 120 South Pantide is backed up from 24 to the Braintree Split in the Canton Braintree area. Down in the Cape, Route 6 on the West Pant side. It is slow from Sandwich all the way to Sandmore Bridge. 20 on the North Pant side. Little slow before the Bourne Waterway up in Bourne. 485 in the Suffolk from 58 in Carver all the way up to 44 in Middleburg. Route 3 on the North Pant side. It's back to 139 in Marshfield all the way up to Derby Street in Hingham. Route 3 in the South Pant side. Little slow in Hingham Stretch. Service Expressway is step on the North Pant side from the split all the way up to the Mass Pack and all the way up to the Tippinil Tunnel in Boston and North Pant side. South Pant side of the Tippinil Tunnel in Boston is looking good. 83 in the South Pant side. back to the Summerville Stretch. Service Express Way, Stubbicko from Dorchester all the way at the Rain Tree. 120 to the North Pantide, a little so around 2 way in Lexington. Route 2, 120 to the South side, a little so around Route 3 in Burlington. 120 to the South Pantide is back to for 95 and Peabody all the way at the Lenfield and Nippet Skin before Route 93 out in Redden. 120 to the North Pantide, a little so around Route 28 in Redden. 45 to the South Pantide, a little so from Route 3 in Milwaukee all the way to the West for 93 under the South Pantide, it's over the long stretch. 45 to the South Pantide, back to the Haverhill stretch. Main turbine on the South Pantide is backed up for Wells all the way out to the New Hampshire border. 95 South Pantide is backed up for Portsmouth to Amesbury. 93 the South Pantide is also Derry, New Hampshire. 93 South Pantide is backed up from 101 in Manchester to Derry, New Hampshire. 93 the South Pantide is backed up from Tilton to Cork, New Hampshire. 89 the South Pantide is also around Cork, New Hampshire. 295 the South Pantide is backed up from Brunswick to Portland. 295 North Pantide is backed up from Portland to Freeport. 95 the South 93 the South Pantide is also in Laconia Stretch. 89 91 the South Pantide is also after Canadian border up in Vermont. I-9 and the North Pantide backed up before the Canadian board up in Vermont. I-87 and the South Pantide a little slow after the Canadian board up in New York State. New York 15 on and the North Pantide a little slow after the U.S. border up in Southern Quebec headed towards Montreal. 
And the New York State Fair in West Pantide. A little sold before 2 in Buffalo and 1 in South Pantide is backed up after the game board up in Niagara Falls. And Peter Channel News Time is now 12.55 on this Sunday afternoon. And it's turning off a weather report. And... If you got plans at the beach, zero because it is a cloudy and a drizzly day. And take a look at radar and it shows a line of rain. So back to the rain shots around the 495 and 120 belt. A little back to the rain shots when Boston there and headed around Milton. And line of rain shots headed down towards Franklin and around Moonstock. And a line of rain shots from Lemster, Mass. Headed up towards Route 2 and headed towards Albany. And Patchy rain shots from Southern Vermont. New Hampshire headed up in the Southern Maine. Patchy rain showers around Stamford, Connecticut, all the way up to Hempstead, New York. All right. Okay, take a look at a seven-day forecast. It goes like this. For today, we are going to have some generally cloudy skies with a slight chance of rain shower high about 75 degrees. Winds east, southeast about 5 to 10 miles an hour. For today, overcast, a straight shower, then swim as possible. Lower at 60 degrees and winds east, northeast at 5 to 10 miles an hour. And going to check out the um, and it is clouding up and it's a little breezy. And it's ha. <laughs> okay, now we're going to take a look at the seven day forecast. Alright, seven day forecast, it goes like this for Monday. Check the shot of the thunderstorms, 40% chance, high about 7 degrees with class guys, with a north east wind about 6 miles an hour. New Haven Mats will be in the tip and quarter an inch possible time at the possible thunderstorms, but Monday night, check the shots before 9 p.m., then I check the shots of the thunderstorms before between 9 p.m. and 1 a.m., then I check the shots after 1 a.m. Patch mark after 3 a.m. and wise. Class guys are about 62 degrees. North freeze are about 6 miles. I just made just 40 percent new break rainfall. So that's a 10 minute check time. That's possible ten storms. For Tuesday, check the shot available before 4 p.m. Punch about before 9 a.m. Most class guys are about 75 degrees. North freeze are about 7 to 9 miles. I just made just 30 percent. Try that. Most class guys are about 60 degrees. For Wednesday, most of the pop guys are about 79 about 60 degrees. For Thursday, most class guys are about 84 about 63 degrees. And for Friday, most class guys are about 87 degrees or about 63 degrees. And for Saturday, check the shot of ten storms. Punch about about 86 degrees. Just make sure that's 30 percent. Try and not near its class guys and it's safe for humidity of 88% and that is going to be it for the Peter Channel. Afternoon news and it's July 31st, 2016 on a Sunday. I'm Peter Taylor. Good afternoon with a good, good positive attitude. I'll hopefully see you for Peter Channel evening news right after the Red Sox Angels game. Have a good afternoon and go Sox!